What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome to another episode of This Is Why I'm Hot. Today guys, we have got Inform Ronaldinho and let me tell you, this guy is an absolute machine. I had so much fun playing with him. I got all these clips in like six games. He is a beast guys, he is a beast. So let me tell you something about the last episode guys. The last episode we had Inform Suarez. The prices on Suarez, Suarez were wrong. They were taken from Foothead instead of Ultimate Team Database. These prices are taken from Ultimate Team database. database. I don't suppose his price will change too much, but I do expect it to raise a little bit. But if you do really want him, his price will drop again. As you can see on the left-hand side, guys, he's an 84-rated cam, the informed version. And his card stats are 61 pace, 82 shooting, 87 passing, 90 dribbling, 43 defense, and 61 heading. He is a 5-star skiller with a 4-star weak foot. I played him in 3-5-2 again, guys. I played him in a, um, a Brazilian team, and that was a fantastic goal there. One of my favorite goals there. Um, and, yeah, that's pretty much all there is to say about him. He's got, uh, on, in that uh, area, well, he's got a couple of traits, the finesse shot, the flare trait, and the playmaker trait. Playmaker trait doesn't really do too much for him in the actual game. Uh, his hot stats this time around, guys, for the reason why he's hot, his hot stats there. His balance of 85 is really, really good. It means he doesn't really get knocked off the ball much, you know, and if he does get tackled, he doesn't fall to the ground. He usually, like, keeps control of the ball and stays there. He's got that 90 vision and 89 curve. So when he's playing the long balls, I didn't didn't really put any passes in this from him although I did have a couple of cracking passes uh, but you know because this is assisted controls it can be easily attributed to FIFA rather than the actual player but um, his passing is is crazy good and he's always in solid positions his ball control of 97 it sticks to his foot like glue it's unbelievable he's so good a uh, volleys 92 short passing 91 shot power of 89 now for a guy with uh, as, who's only an 84 cam that's crazy good but then his most unbelievable attribute free kicks 92 to, to be paired up with the curve of 89 or oh, wait does that say yeah, no sorry 99 curve of course 99 um, apologies there uh, and the shot power of 89 it makes his free kicks disgusting before this before I bought in for Ronaldinho I had only ever scored two free kicks in FIFA 13 and in the six games that I played with him, I scored four free kicks and I hit the bar from one as well. He's unbelievable in that department. I, I'm a massive, massive fan of Ronaldinho anyway. I thought his 88 card in FIFA 11 was the best card I'd ever played with in any uh, FIFA game. Um, but you just look at some of these goals that I score with him. Like I say, the ball sticks to his feet, guys. He's an insane player. He cost 99,000 coins on PlayStation and 95,000 coins on Xbox. And that, that free kick there just epitomizes his free kick abilities. And they are insane. I, I don't know if you guys have had trouble scoring free kicks in FIFA 13. I know I most certainly have even with like good players for them uh, I've you know sometimes when you get a free kick like 18 20 yards out usually it's it's a guaranteed goal uh, with even players with like average free kick stats uh, but in FIFA 13 it's a lot harder it's a lot different but with Ronaldinho they go in every single time um, I, th I thought I'd do a cam this time guys instead of a striker and I, like I say I was playing him as the cam in the th in a 3-5-2 I was focusing the play through him a little bit but not too much but he just scored some cracking goals for me he was a joy to play with and you can put him in so many different hybrid teams because he's from Liga do Brasil he plays for Atletico Mineiro um, he's, his regular card is like 8,000 to 10,000 coins I think he's quite cheap uh, for a 5 star skiller he is a little bit on the slow side with only the 61 pace but all the other stats he has makes up for that and he's just a joy to play with uh, you can like I say you can put him in Brazilian teams in Liga do Brazil teams um, you can put him in like hybrid teams where you just have you know him as a cam and then you know Pato up front and Wellington or something like that and then you can have like any midfield you want because he'll still get nine chem he's just unreal guys definitely go out and buy this guy hit the like button if you wouldn't mind it means a lot to me and helps out my channel a lot thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you for the next episode cheers